Premier, we have with us today a number of First Nations members from the Rama First Nation and their Tribal Council, and they're here again for one simple reason. The Crown in 1764 said that First Nations would be exempt from paying certain taxes. Your government has negotiated with the federal government an HST that's going to be implemented on July 1st. My question to you is simply this. Why did you not ensure to exempt them in the first place when you negotiated this HST with the, with the federal government? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And I, I welcome uh, the question from the member. And I do want to welcome, there are many people from First Nations who are visiting us today at Queen's Park, particularly Grand Chief Patrick Madabi is here. So we welcome you and we're delighted that you're here, both inside and outside of the legislature. I say to the member that um, it is important to remember that for some 30 years now, all the parties in this House have had the privilege of having government, and we have always provided, since I think about 1980, a point of sale exemption in regard to the provincial sales tax. Now, on July the 1st, there will be no provincial sales tax. There will be just one harmonized sales tax in Ontario, administered by the federal government. We have reached an agreement with them that uh, under the administrative rules of the federal government, and what they do right across the country, is that when a First Nations person is on reserve, there is no sales tax. When they're off reserve... Supplementary. The buck stops with you, Minister. It is your HSD. It's not the federal government's HSD. It is you that has implemented this policy, and it was up to you as a government to ensure that the point of sale exemption was in place when you negotiated it. So I ask you again, why don't you take your responsibility and ensure by July 1st there will be a point of sale exemption? It's Dalton McGinsey's HSD. Well, Minister. Mr. Speaker, despite the, despite the bluster, let's get to the facts. On July the 1st, there is no provincial sales tax. There is but one harmonized sales tax administered solely by the federal government. We have said to the federal government that we believe that the administrative practice in the province of Ontario that sees a point of sale exemption should be maintained in the province of Ontario. First Nations are rightly frustrated, as is our government, as should all members be frustrated by the fact that the federal government refuses to sit down at the table where we have been working with First Nations. The administrator of the tax has to agree, and to date they have not. That is why we are calling, and we should all call on the federal government to actually...